First, it's a, I believe that it's a sense of purpose and it's a sense of selflessness uh, for people who are acting, the healthcare workers, uh, people who are really making a difference. Um, I guess who mentored me would be my father. My father was a state senator. Prior to that, he was a city councilman early on in the city of Hammond. And he was always able to recognize, you know, what was important to people as a city councilman. He always wanted to make sure that people's property were protected based on anything that was going on. And, um, you know, just the common good of your core values of who you are while you're growing up is that, um, you know, you run, my dad ran for office, but he always found a way to utilize his position to help others. And um, the township trustee's office, um, you know what, I, I have to go back to this. I have a phenomenal staff too. Lori Polgar, who's my chief of staff, um, Brett Bierman, uh, Burge Carter, Gilda Orange. You know, it's an all hands on deck kind of approach when we go through times like this. And if, you know, the township trustee's office are used to dealing with people who are having their own personal emergencies every single day. And so when you uh, are able to find a sense of calm uh, during that and be able to give hope and assurances that we'll get through those things, it becomes part of who you are. As a township trustee, when the flood came in 2008, I mentioned that just because that was a, um, a preparedness um, moment to be able to see how we would handle our next disaster. And there was an organization put together, which is NISA, the Northwest Indiana Security and Sharing Alliance, where I sat on that board with, um, or on the executive committee to make sure that we are, it's five counties wide, Lake, Porter, LaPorte, uh, Jasper, Newton, and Pulaski. And what we do is we come together and have done exercises for the last 12 to 13 years, making sure that we're prepared and making sure that private industry is included and making sure that everyone is communicating. Because when we had the flood in 2008, a lot of private industry had assets that the public would be able to have access to. And we have torn down those barriers. And, um, so building strong relationships in your community and whatever your social, you know, whatever network you're in is important. Being a credible character and uh, more importantly, being able to execute deliverables that people understand are best for the community.